save our planet. Climate change linked to harmful waterborne diseases. Evaluating the ocean effects of factors such as rising temperature and pollutants, researchers from the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, or NOAA, recently found that adverse conditions such as those created by toxic algal blooms could be extended for up to three months in vulnerable coastal areas. The toxic algae, which typically bloom from July to October, can accumulate in shellfish and, if consumed by humans, can cause paralysis or even death. In fact, millions of sardine recently found dead in a Southern California, USA harbor were later found to have been contaminated with the paralyzing neurotoxin, domoic acid, that likely originated in toxic algae in the region. In another study, scientists from the University of Georgia in the USA found that desert dust settling on seawater results in a swift and significant increase in vibrios, a type of ocean bacteria that can cause infectious diseases in humans. Airborne dust due to land desertification has been increasing in the last decades and is expected to continue to rise. Noting its potentially dangerous effect, study spokesperson Eric Lipp stated, within 24 hours of mixing weathered desert dust from Morocco with seawater samples, we saw a huge growth in vibrios, including one strain that could cause eye, ear and open wound infections, and another strain that could cause cholera. As we mourn the many deaths of the precious finned fish life, we appreciate the work of the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration scientists in highlighting this harmful climate change effect. May humanity make full use of the opportunity we now have to mitigate such conditions through our eco-conscious lifestyles.